So Matthew, one thing that strikes me about 2010 is the level of alcohol in a lot of wines. Some are more than 15. I've heard of wines that were 16 degrees. Some are balanced, some aren't balanced. What do you think? Of course, when we have a majority the Merlot, it's always more difficult to, to get the, a good balance of alcohol. The, the Cabernet helps us a lot to, to get down the, the alcohol. Uh, but this year, it, um, the alcohol was less than 2009 and 10. Uh, 9 and 10 was two, two vintages uh, hot, so with the balance, of course, around 14, 15 uh, degrees alcohol. But also, when you, when you have high alcohol, you have to be careful because it, it, it takes more wood, it, yeah. you get more extraction, yeah. so you have to be careful. For the right? balance with the, the wood and the, the fruits, we have to be careful, so um, um, we will choose the barrels uh, with the Cooper Edge, we will talk about what can we do exactly to get the good wood. And the fruits is very important also. But uh, I think 2009 and 2010, um, the balance for us is, is amazing. It's mm -hmm. amazing. With the, um, the time, we, um, we have to wait, I think. We have to be patient uh, for everybody. But I'm sure in, f in a few years, uh, we will get uh, the result we're waiting for. But don't you even tasting the wines like the Angelus, I love the fruit. It makes you want to drink it right away, even though it's too young. You just, wow, it's so yeah. delicious. At the moment, we can test uh, yeah. easy, we want it easy, but uh, we need to wait <laughs> one more time. <laughs> uh, I think we, uh, yeah, with time, uh, it will be uh, a lot better. But at the moment, uh, for doing the primer, it's, it's, it's good. Huh? What, what about, so, uh, sometimes I found the 2009, you didn't see the rich fruit and alcohol as much as 2010. What was the difference in the growing season? Between, sorry? 2009 and 2010, the difference between the season of... 2009, is, for, for us, is maybe the, the, the top, top, top. 2010 is more... It's, um, it's two vintages very different because the summer was very different, hot, of course, but uh, with um, a back uh, season, with um, with um, uh, um, um, uh, the pluie, um, oh, with some rain. With rain, so it, it helps us to, to get more um, um, a wine more um, balance. Yeah, with oh, a ba better balance. Uh, we can compare a little bit to 2009 and 2012. Is they're um, that close? 2010, it's more rich with a lot of fruits, black fruits. Uh, uh, Interesting. Good. Yeah. Because the perception is that nine is the richer year, but ten is almost richer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome. Merci. Pleasure. <laughs>